Let's look at the difference between addition and concatenation. And a good way to do this is to do a semi-case study with the character data type. And let's say that I gave you the name John Baby Doe, and I wanted you to print out his first, middle, and last initials. The program would probably look something like this. You store J as a first initial, B as his middle initial, and D as his last initial, and they're all stored as the character data type. And then you add a system out print line statement with first, middle, and last initial. And the question is, is this going to add or concatenate? And you would probably expect it to concatenate, meaning that it would print out J, B, and D and link those three values together. But interestingly enough, it's not going to do that. What it's going to do is it's going to print out 208. And you say, well, why in the world is it choosing to do that? The answer is, is that it's using the ASCII values as opposed to linking the symbolic values together, J, B, and D. And so what we get are 74, 66, and 68. And if you add those three values together, you get 208. So hopefully you see the problem that I'm trying to address here. In an output statement, when is it going to concatenate and when is it going to add? Well, when you have a primitive like a character, it is going to add, so we have a character literal, capital A, plus 5, and we would get 70. Or we have a lowercase d, which is 100 in ASCII, and if we added 10, we would get 110. And because we're using two primitives here, like character and character, when we say let 1 plus let 2, it's not going to concatenate. It is going to add them together. So if we were to run this program, we would get 180. But if we just had character let one a plus five, and we just printed out let one, we would interestingly enough get the capital letter F. You say, well, why is that? Well, the reason is, is there's no concatenation or addition happening here. There is addition happening right here with the plus sign, but down here in the system out print line, there's no addition happening. So again, we say, why are we getting addition versus concatenation? And it has to do with the plus sign and what choice the compiler is going to make. Is it going to add or is it going to concatenate? And in this case, we are well aware that it's going to add. This is true of our first example where we did first initial plus middle initial plus last initial. Well, is there a case where instead of adding that we could make it concatenate? And let's watch what happens when I add the string literal my initials are in front of first, middle, and last initial. Is it going to concatenate or add? And it's going to concatenate. We would actually get the value my initials are JBD. And you say, well, why is this happening? There are not just characters, but a string literal has been introduced. And these plus signs are no longer adding, but rather they are concatenating. And the rule is this, if a string is involved, concatenation will occur, otherwise expect addition. So if we have the string, my initials are, and the character or primitive data type, first initial, the plus sign is going to look to its left and look to its right and say, am I going to add or concatenate? Well, if it finds a string, it's going to concatenate. And so this would become my initials are J. Then the next plus sign would look to its left and look to its right and determine, hey, am I going to concatenate or am I going to add? Well, I don't have a string and a primitive here. I have two primitives being character and character. So you would think that it would add, but this is not the case. And let me tell you why. It doesn't look at the left and see just first initial. What it sees is my initials are space J. And so it's really a longer string that it's going to add middle initial to. And it's not going to add, it's going to concatenate. And so now we would have my initials are JB. And then in the last case, we're looking at an even longer string saying my initials are JB. And it would concatenate on the last initial saying my initials are JBD. The important thing to get out of this is whenever the compiler finds a string, it's going to start to concatenate instead of add. And it's always going to evaluate from left to right. It starts at the leftmost symbol, evaluating to the rightmost symbol. Now, what happens if I just want to print out JBD? 
we're back to the original problem of having first initial, middle initial, and last initial together, and it would print out 208. Is there any way that we can make the compiler decide to concatenate instead of add? Well, what we can do is we can add an empty string in front of first, middle, and last initial. And what that does is it tells the compiler that I want to concatenate instead of add. And if I were to run this program right now, I would get JBD as opposed to 208. In this example, what I want to show you is that both addition and concatenation can happen in a system out print line statement. If a string is involved, it's going to concatenate. But as we can see in the first two values, they are both not strings. They are of the primitive data type integers. And so if we take one int and add it to another int, it is going to add, not concatenate, and we would get the value 10. Then we would look at 10 as a whole and say, what am I going to do with middle? Well, because middle is a string, I'm going to concatenate. So I would get 10 middle. Next, I would look at the string 10 middle and the int 8. Well, because a string is involved, it's going to concatenate, not add, and I would get 10 middle 8. And lastly, the compiler would have to decide what to do with the two. And the plus operator would find a string on its left, an int on its right. It would concatenate, and so therefore we would get 10 middle 82. Is there a way to make it say 10 middle 10? What if I didn't want it to concatenate at the end, I wanted it to add? And the way that we could do this is to add parentheses around the 8 plus 2. Parentheses change the order of operations, so the 8 and 2 would be added first, and then it would go back and do its normal order of operations from left to right. So it would print 10 middle 10 in this case. In this video, I very much wanted to show you the difference between addition and concatenation, especially in terms of a system out print line statement. And a good way to do this is to show characters, which kind of straddle both worlds of looking like a character, but really being an integer value. And so whenever you're working with characters, be careful because sometimes they will act like numeric values and sometimes they will print their symbolic value like 70 being the numeric value or capital F being the ASCII value. The plus operator is really at the heart of this video. Sometimes the plus operator can mean addition and sometimes it can mean concatenation. If a string is anywhere involved to the left or to the right of the operator, it is going to concatenate and not add. But if you have two primitives, like two characters or two integers, it is going to add. If you want to circumvent the normal process or normal order of operations, you can add parentheses around something and that will add instead of concatenate, therefore ensuring addition. If you're not aware of the difference between addition and concatenation, sometimes you will get odd results, like characters printing numeric values. Be sure to know the rules associated with the overloaded plus operator, whether it's going to add or concatenate. Doing so will help you get the output you desire.